Well, well, well. Well, 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 well. If it isn't my friends at the guild. How are you all doing today? Happy Friday, my friends. Jezriah, Raya, good morning. Oh, Volk. Oh, heck yeah. <laughs> my amazing revenge. Being first year stream. Never forgot, did you? Congrats on being first. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good day. I totally thought this out. Not me instantly looking for the join the wagon redeem. Good morning, Spooky. Uh, don't worry, that redeem is coming. Good morning, Blue. Funny thing is, this is only my second time coming to his stream. Yeah, so what happened was... Oh, by the way, Latte. Not yet mixed. I don't even know how this happened. You got the milk settled on the bottom. The espresso here in the middle. And then more milk foam, I guess? So, I'm about to stir it. But, uh... I just thought that was kind of cool looking. <laughs> Coleman, good morning. How you doing? I put a back update in the general chat in the Discord. Have moderate narrowing in L4 and L5. Small 3mm bone spur and slight narrowing in L3. So, are they, uh, do they have a plan of attack? I'm gonna miss the wagon on my drive into the office, I bet. Oh no! When are you leaving? When are you leaving? I do have to get this thing started pretty soon. Um, uh, I was gonna fill you guys in on some events that have taken place, um, and part of the reason why I don't know exactly how long stream is going today, but hoping we'll be able to get a full run of Oregon Trail in. So I clicked in the stream, I was looking for the join the wagon redeem too. Clark loots in the house. I, you know, I'll I'll explain. I'll explain. All right. I hold grudges. Well, what about friendship grudges? Can you hold a friendship grudge? That Henley though. Stop. Hello, Lady Iron. Just put my shoes on and grabbing my keys. Well, ah, dang. I do have to fill you in on some stuff real quick. <laughs> so yesterday was an eventful. Um, <clears throat> it was eventful. Like. It's so funny. I, one of my athletes asked how my day was, and I was like, my day was really boring. Until it wasn't. Um, I didn't have much to do at work yesterday. And um, after work, basically, I was going to go to this uh, like local competition. as an all-comers competition, so it's it's not like a super serious competition or anything. But I had like some of my athletes were going to go as well. And so um, gearing up to get ready to leave... And um, Mrs. Magoots was going to go do some some errands of her own. She takes her car out. Garage closes, and I hear bang, 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 bang. And I was like, what the heck was that? Run out to the garage, and I'm like, I don't see anything. And then it kind of dawned on me. I was like, oh, our spring has been in trouble lately. The spring, like, split in half. So our garage door is now stuck in the down position, and uh, my car is stuck inside. She at least does have her car out. But my car is stuck inside. Um, so I call her. She ended up coming back because I, I mean, I had to go to this. I, I even had to take take some athletes to the competition. So um, so she comes back and then uh, she basically gets stuck at home, which really sucks. Um, and then um, and then, yeah, um, one of our neighbor's chickens got into our yard, which was a whole ordeal. Um, so it was just like thing after th like real quick bang, 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 things happening. Uh, and then I had to leave. Uh, because, you know, got athletes relying on me, so. So anyway, um, busy day today because we have to take the, we have to take the car, I have to take the car into the shop. Um, it needs an oil change. And then beyond that, um, we're supposed to have a garage guy coming from 10 to noon, somewhere 10 to noon today. So I might have to end stream, um, a little early if he gives me a call. So we'll just... We'll see what he says. See when they call. Um, but yeah, that's that's the that's the update. Also, man, I do need a new chair. This chair just will not hold its position anymore. But focusing on stretching and loosening my back muscles and strengthening my core muscles. My back is pulling too hard. And my front muscles are not pulling enough. Yeah. Yeah, that's a I feel like that's that's a that's a comp well, the muscular issue. Can't speak to the bones, but the muscular part, that sounds 
pretty common. We're all kind of forward tilted. Not all, but a lot of us are forward tilted. Bang, 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 just like the spring. Pretty much, yeah. I knew about this, yeah. Yeah, um, so the most surprising thing about it was, um, yeah, Ginny somehow caught the chicken, which we're just like, I don't even know how that's possible. Now, when she was younger, that would that would have made perfect sense. She was very, very fast, um, but she doesn't have, like, she has no strength in her back legs anymore, so I have no, we have no idea how this chicken got caught, um, but yeah. Sorry, I must admit, y'all American folks are strange. Why do you have... M&M's with pretzels inside? Well, that sounds good to me. I've never tried them, though, I don't think. Bones are completely fine and healthy. Hips, pelvis, and spine. Good to hear. Good to hear. I'm not American, but it's because it's delicious. It's unnecessary. <laughs> Wait, what would what would you what would you prefer? What would you prefer? All right, spooky. I don't know how. Uh, I don't know how far along in the um, leaving process you are, but uh, it sounds like you're probably on your way. Um, I don't have a lot of time, but uh, I, at the same time, M and M's with caramel in it is good too, or is good though. I th I don't know. I mean, I I don't know if I've had the pretzel ones or not, but I feel like the pretzel ones would be good. Yeah, pretzel m ms rock. I feel like they'd be good. I like chocolate-covered pretzels. Mend you on that discovery. <laughs> if you think if you think m ms are weird, you should see a lot of our other food. We love deep frying stuff around here. You rock. Your face rocks. Face rocks hard. Just got in the car. Oh, man. <sighs> I'm not really ready, but like... Oh, shoot. Where did my tab go? There it is. Okay. What if we try to get one in here now? You got to be the quickest person. Someone else will have to die of dysentery in my stead. Ah, uh, Coleman hit it. Coleman hit it. Coleman got the one for now. Sorry, Spooky. I guess uh, Coleman's in your place. He'll take good care of you. That was quick. That was quick. I just flipped the switch and it was like, mobile isn't even showing it. Yeah. Didn't realize there was only one for now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was trying to sneak one in. Trying to sneak one in. Um, okay, stand by. Okay, uh, check. Do a check, 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 do a check. Check that. One, two, test, check. Check one, two. Checking. Check one, two. Check. 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 I don't know how quickly they will, uh, they will update. <laughs> Can I claim for Spooky? Oh, I was supposed to actually make that a, uh, nice. I should make that a, uh, Redemption per user per stream. We only get four. We only get four of them. Uh, there we go. I don't know if me enabling and disabling restarts the counter, though. All right. Well, there you go. I think maybe if, if Nander visits us, visits us today, then we don't have any, like, internet issues and whatnot. I'll uh, probably return those on just as they're joining us. And then, hey, put that in. I've been licking her paws a lot lately. <clears throat> oh, but yeah, so today, busy day. Um, very busy day. Chaotic, hello. How you doing? So after stream is done, um, I like I said, we'll have that guy come and uh, hopefully fix our garage, so I'll be able to get vehicles in and out of the garage, and then, uh, and then after that, I have to leave like pretty much immediately. Well, I mean, maybe even before, probably before he's even done, I'm gonna have to leave because um, I have a uh, my second podiatrist appointment today, um, and then when I get back, 
I'm going to have to take a vehicle to, uh, hopefully our garage will be fixed by then. I have to take a vehicle to the uh, local shop for an oil change. Um, it's just like all again. And it's like, I'm supposed to work at some point in there too. So just built a new chair today. Very nice. You did? What kind of chair was it? And Crystal, good morning. I need a new chair, something fierce. Hopefully you can get your door open so you can pull the car out before he would start working on the new spring. Oh, that's a good, that's a good point. Yeah, if he can do that, that would be a huge help. It's a mesh chair with proper back support. Heck yeah. Nice, nice, nice. I've been, I, I haven't really made a good decision on like what chair I'm going to get whenever I do get one. I just know that I, this one is just starting to fall apart. It, which is like actually kind of good. This this chair was under a hundred dollars. I'm pretty sure on eBay, uh, like years ago. I think I got it probably in 2018, 2019. Um, so yeah, it's lasted me a long time considering how cheap it was. But it's at this point now it's starting to fall apart. Doing all right, Crystal. I overslept this morning. Um, I I I meant to look back at my alarms. It looked like I had, normally, it, I sometimes have one earlier alarm and then a later alarm. Maybe my eyes just didn't see the clock right, but my alarm went off and I was like, ah, oh, it's too early. And I looked at my watch and it seemed like it was the early alarm. So I like snoozed it or whatever. And then I'm pretty sure I snoozed it, but maybe I just canceled it. And then next thing I know, I wake up and it was like, you know, I was supposed to have been out of bed like 40 minutes before, so. Dog pets. <laughs> yeah, one of my puppers is in here. Jimbin, what's licking? Look at that. She's under my desk over here. But other than that, I'm doing all right. I mean, it's it's Friday. That's a really good thing. Um, should be a nice chill weekend. Should be a real nice chill weekend. So definitely looking forward to that. <clears throat> All right, let's uh let's maybe swap over here to uh we swap over, start getting organ trails set up. Do I even have this? Yeah, I, okay. I do. Actually, I've already got the game going. We're pretty good. Need to go for the charity event already. We smashed the goal in three days. Did you really? What um what uh what was the goal? I don't know why but you look super familiar. Um well you have been here before, right? Could it be that? Could that be it at all? The goal was a thousand, you're at eleven fifteen. Heck yeah. Nice. That's awesome. And uh, is it a week long? Is that what I is that what I recall? Was it a, is it going to be a week? But do you this will get your uh, what you've raised in three days? Yeah, that's dope. Dope. I thought a week actually is two. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay two-week thing yeah that's awesome <laughs> okay gosh I have been getting so many like just how many emails of this am I getting a day I guess they aren't sending multiple a day. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, they were all different. But man, it just seems like I'm getting too many emails. Uh, they send daily emails. That's what it is. Or almost daily emails. Uh, Kelt, you good? You good, my friend? Super happy about that. Makes me super happy. Definitely. Definitely. That's awesome. What uh? What do you think you'll bump the goal to? Hello there. One second. Oh, that's something different than I was thinking. Hello there, Kels. 
Y'all hope you're doing all right. My son's cat sends hellos. 8U... 8UI9... Your son's cat. What's your son's cat's name? We would like to send hellos back. Just checking here. I don't think I need any of these. Eh? Hello there. Hello there. Kel had a kelt a kelt down. <laughs> Similar to a meltdown. But more on brand. Alright. Let's go ahead and perfect. Okay. Wanted to clean some of these dang emails out. Kel, how's your Friday going thus far? How's everybody's weekend looking? How's everybody's uh what's the plan? What's the plan here for the weekend? For me, um, this is actually my um, yours just started. Oh, did it really? I'm jealous. I'm jealous. Uh, this is my birthday weekend coming up here, so um, it should be pretty chill still. I'm not uh, I'm not planning on anything big for my birthday, but um, but it's just uh, it'll be good. We need to work on this DIY dog fence. We need to work on it. Hoping my cousin is able to catch a flight here. Supposed to pick him up this afternoon. Ooh, okay. Heck yeah. Work until I'm done. Spend time with Lutz and VC if he wants. <laughs> That'd be very cool. I wish I had the day off. Um, I'm going to be freaking running around all over today. But, uh, but other than that, like this weekend, I should be chill. I think. Happy birthday whenever it is. It'll be on Sunday. Thank you, Obolk. I think tomorrow I'm helping a friend move into his new house. Ooh, that's very kind of you, Jezreya. Moving is not the easiest of tasks. It's already coming up on June 30th, yeah. Are you doing another draft tomorrow? Not really sure yet. Two people Don has been speaking with about who helped him set it up. They're apparently looking into pushing the goal. I think we didn't know what to expect and didn't see this turnout coming. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, take it. I mean, there's no, no rush to figure it out. No rush to figure it out. Hello, Koro. How are you doing today? Sunday will be recovery day, especially with my back. I definitely will be sore. Yeah. Yeah, definitely take it easy on Sunday. I was trying to think of... I wanted to do something a little bit a little bit unique or fun on Monday. Um, kind of as a, as a birthday treat. But um, I haven't quite figured out the details of that. So I'll have to take the next day or two. Grandpa's surgery went okay. All right. <clears throat> um, I don't know what the quotes mean, but I hope he's uh, I hope he's okay. I hope he's able to um just focus on some recovery. Off Monday won't be distracted for stream. Oh, you're off Monday. Okay is better than bad. That's that was what I was thinking. Yeah, hope all is well. Hmm, hang on one second, Coleman. Let me see something. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Hang on, maybe I should... Uh, let me check Discord. Had an idea, but I don't know if it's... If it's feasible or possible. Canada Day Monday. Yeah. Heck yeah. And then it's America Day on... Uh, what day is America Day? Thursday. Thursday. Uh, this hat here. I don't think I have an answer. I was just wondering. I was like, well, could we do like a, could we participate in the Twitch drops and hunt showdown? But they announced them a week ago. So maybe they'll, maybe they'll announce something this, uh, this afternoon, but they did not give a date on that. So I have to imagine it's not going to be next week. So anyway, anyways, you have Thursday and Friday off. Um, I have, I definitely have Thursday off. 
Well, I think I'm taking Friday off as well, but Friday we are uh, hitting the road at some point to uh, to we're re we rescheduled a like a little weekend getaway that we actually had on the docket for um, we had on the docket for last year around this time and uh, had to cancel. So it's it's a reschedule. So we're gonna be out of town this weekend. Hello, Nonder and Nonsters. Cheers. Welcome in, my friends. Hello there. How are you all doing? Cheers. Clumsy, good morning. Ursa, good morning. Nonder, good morning. How are you all doing today? And Gabby, hello. How are you doing? Um, I think the surgery was successful. It'll be a long recovery. His intestines aren't moving food through his body right now. Really? Gabby. Thank you so much for this. Has it seriously been six months? Jeez. Cheers. That is just so unreal. Cheers to you, Gabby. Thank you so much. Can we get some cheers up in the chat, my friend? Cheers ups in the chats for both Nonder and Gabby. Thank you so much, Nan, for the raid. Um, friends, you're going to want to check your channel point redeems. Um, we have a new one out there that is extra exclusive right now. <clears throat> oh, there we go. We've got our last two. I they're they're supposed to be limited to four, and we already had two redeemed. So somehow we got a uh, we got six. We got some backups. All right, we got some backups. It'll be Ursa and Koro hitting the trail, uh, along with Coleman and Spooky, um, and Blue and Nander. I'm putting you on the on the top, and if we happen to die, you guys are first in on the next one. All right. Um, and we probably will die, if we're being honest. It is Oregon Trail, after all. Reserve squad. <laughs> Make me want to put in more effort to my appearance, and I'm not sure how I feel about that. It's <laughs> Hey, Smoochie Daddy Summer's for everybody, right? For everybody. Dads and non-dads alike. Um, fellas and non-fellas alike. It's for everybody. Um... It's all up to you on what you want to do. <laughs> so, sorry I didn't get to your stream, Nandra. I was harassing Lutz. <laughs> Hope it's fun. Yeah, me too. It should be a good time. It is the place with the theme cabins. It is, Coleman. Yeah. Uh, have a band I'm going to see tonight. D&D tomorrow night, maybe Sunday. Oh, Kelt. That sounds like a freaking fantastic weekend. I have an issue with my Tiltify overlay that I think I had mentioned to you. Good news, I'm fairly sure I got that figured out. That, yeah, that's good. That's really good, Crystal. Thursday, that's less important. <laughs> less important than Canada Day. I'm going to die and Coleman's going to take him. Well, maybe, maybe. Should we get to some Oregon Trail? Let me, uh, let me go ahead and do this here. Pause this. Oh, shoot. One sec. I did not unmute this. Uh, there we go. You guys ready for some Oregon Trail? Which theme one you getting? I think ours is just the, uh, like, the country... The country cottage kind of theme. Um, we didn't get... We didn't spring for, like, one of the, the real kitschy ones. Uh, the reason we actually got it uh, originally was because we were supposed to bring Ginny with us last year um but it ended up being real rainy that weekend and then jenny got sick so it was like well we're gonna have to keep her inside um that would have been a pain so omena oh, hello how are you doing clumsy is so non-brain too wait what did clumsy say not the non-fellas exactly <laughs> oh we're doing a trail run we're doing a trail run crystal Blue, my apologies. I didn't mean to leave you on red. Uh, I know you sent me a message. I wasn't able to respond. We had a uh, an unfortunate a series of unfortunate events took place, like right around the time I got your message. So I'll get back to you though. Did you complete the task I required of you? I did. I did. Um, and that is part of the reason why I am uh, I'm late to stream. Also, I hope I don't catch the uh, certain influenza here. Look who's harassing the streamer. I know, right? I know. I was like, guys, the wind is going to take care of this. Like, but all right. 
No daily combo. Oh, we had a daily combo. Huh. Sorry about that, clumsy. We'll do that. Oh, gosh. When's the last time you went dancing? When's the last time you went dancing? Um, <clears throat> I think the last... I was trying to think of the last um, wedding that I went to, but that would have been it. Um, did I go to another wedding since since my uh, one of my friends from college? Awkwardly dancing my cousin's sweet 16 count? I think it does, yeah. I don't, I don't like dancing. It's not my thing. I don't enjoy it. Um, so... I don't really go dancing, you know what I mean? But I would say it was my friend's, one of my friend's wedding. I'm trying to think, was that really two years ago? My brother-in-law? Um, there was no dancing, actually, if you can believe it. Well, I mean, I guess you could have danced. Um, but the reception was basically just like a party bus. Um, so just kind of like rode around. I didn't really, there was no real dancing. There was, I mean, I guess there was at least at one point, everybody, st everybody stood up on the bus and like, you got to hold on to the, <laughs> the bar up top and, you know, maybe just do a couple of these. <laughs> That's all about all you can do. There's no room to dance. Dancing, I can't remember. Wish I had known the guild before my wedding. Oh. He was for a good cause. You made him late. No worries at all, Lutz. I know you're busy, man. Hope all is well, though. It It is. It'll be fine. Yeah, it was just it was kind of a hectic, hectic period right there. Um, I'm going to go ahead and hit this travel the trail button so we can get that music to stop playing because, man, is it it's kind of a lot. Welcome to the Oregon Trail. You're about to begin a great adventure traveling the Oregon Trail across the rugged landscape of North America. Your covered wagon, pulled by a team of oxen, will travel from Independence, Missouri, to the fertile Willamette Valley in the Oregon Territory, a journey of approximately 2,000 miles. This also gives you an idea about how big the United States is for anybody that's not from the U.S. Uh, the United States is kind of a large place. Um... Independence, Missouri is, um, I'd say that's like the middle, like the middle of the United States. Um, and then you're going up to, uh, Northwest, uh, us and, um, that's 2000 miles. So that's like maybe half <laughs> halfway of the diagonal of our country here. So anyway, uh, before you set off on the trail, you must register your name, the names of the members of your wagon party and your occupation. After that, you'll need to buy supplies and make other important decisions. Good luck. Supplies, mother freaker. All right. Um. So I will be. Uh, I will be the the um. The party. Uh, the party leader here. But uh, our first person was Coleman, and then we had Spooky, and then we had Ursa and Coro. So that's our party for this one, but uh, don't worry. I, uh, I have a feeling we might need to do a second run, so. Uh, you helicoptered? Uh, well, I, I wouldn't say I wouldn't go that far. If you want to see the definition of no rhythm, this gal right here. Yeah, I don't, I don't feel like I'm a natural dancer. That's part of the reason why I don't like it so much. But. I uh, wouldn't call it going dance. It's more like trying not to break both my uh, cerebral palsy having legs while doing what more mobile people gener generously call dancing with Steph in our living room. What a great team. Um, let's see here. What would be the closest? I mean, I think I got to go with Blacksmith. I mean, come on. We've been playing some Kingdom Come Deliverance. I got to go with Blacksmith. What does the Blacksmith, uh, what does blacksmith uh, get here? We get $800 redos. Uh, more likely to repair broken wagon parts. My final bonus is times two. I don't care about that, though. But, um, feeling quite hungry. I will murder you on this trail. How long before we start? Wait, hang on. What? And affirming him. Oh, my goodness. Uh, affirming him. You need to decide when to set off on the trail. If you leave too early, there won't be much grass for your oxen to eat. You may encounter some very cold weather and late spring snowstorms. 
But if you leave too late, you may not to get to Oregon before winter, which can be very dangerous. If you leave at just the right time, there will be gra green grass and, for the most part, mild weather. We should leave in April, obviously, right? Like, like you have a choice, but that's kind of, uh, kind of funny here. All right. And I didn't realize there is no, there is no music whatsoever. At this part, the, the intro was maybe a little bit much, but I also didn't expect it to be nothing. I bet spooky would protect me. Hello, beautiful Kirk. How you doing? To make Steph happy, I'll do anything, but I uh, consider me trying to dance a dangerous endeavor. Yeah, I would say so. I would say so. We're going to want as many oxen as we can get. Sets of clothing be good. Boxes of bullets. You don't really need that many bullets, right? Spare wagon wheels, wagon axles. Uh, pounds of food. How, how often, I mean, how, how quickly does the food go bad? I don't really remember. Terry, hello. Welcome in, Terry. Cheers. How often do you need to eat? Well, that's not really what I was going to say. I was just like, how quickly does the food go bad? <laughs> Cheers, Terry. Welcome in. Ooh, another New Vegas, sir. How is, um, how is New Vegas going? I need a time machine so I can go home and play the new Final Fantasy expansion. Is it, um, uh, are you at work right now, Kirk? Gosh, I hate that. Do you want me to call, do you want me to call you out of work? Matt can give you some pretty good advice about what to buy. Oh, wait, hang on. I shouldn't. I recommend at least six oxen to pull your wagon. And you'll need plenty of flour, sugar, bacon, coffee, bacon. and other types of food. I food. I suggest you start out with at least 200 pounds of food for each person in your party. Each person? Good, warm clothing, especially for the mountains. I recommend taking at least two sets of clothes per person. You'll need ammunition, too. Each box of ammunition contains 20 bullets. Finally, you might want to take along some spare wagon parts. Wagon wheels, axles, and tongues are liable to This voice actor is definitely from Minnesota, Wisconsin area. Wagon. You'll be in big wagon. Okay. All right. Well, um, let's see. Six oxen to pull the wagon. I'm bringing more than that for sure. All right. So uh, two sets of clothing for each person would be wait there are five of us right so we need 10 sets of clothing there goes an eighth of our money i'm gonna just buy a couple boxes of bullets i don't think i'm gonna need that many all right bear wagon wheels let's go ahead and buy let's buy them out on that that's 90 dollars there uh then again 20 cents per pound of food oh this is gonna be a lot actually he said 200 pounds per person i'm off hope you enjoy your game thank you so much terry wagon wagon you guys can eat me when I die. Starting to fall asleep is decently late here. Going to get some sleep. See you, Lutes. Oh, well, thanks so much for hanging out. Uh, I need Dawn Trail first, and then some sub cash. So I'm playing ESO instead and feeling real hard draw towards e Eoreza. I have no idea how to say that. That is a lot of vowels for one word. Might I make a slight suggestion? You can, sure. I, I mean, No promises, but you sure can. Um, okay. He said 200 pounds per person. That's a thousand pounds, which actually only $200 dues. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Um, and then I was going to buy, I was going to buy at least 12 oxen. I mean, at least you probably want to keep some money left over, right? Bagel. How do we, how do we feel about this? Maybe I can even do, uh, we could even do like 1200 pounds. But I mean, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have I'm gonna come across chances to get food. Like food, I can hunt pretty quick, right? I don't know how often I'll be able to buy bullets, so maybe I need to buy a couple more. Mr. Candyman, how are you doing? If I do ten boxes of bullets, six hundred and ninety dollars, nice. Also known as sixty nine times ten, nice. We'll go with that. I think this is a good amount to to start with here. Actually, we could well. We could do maybe some more clothing if we did 15 sets of clothing. That's that only leaves me $60 use though. Yeah. I don't know. There are other stores in the area. There are other stores around. Sorry, I'm so distracted. You're good. All good. <clears throat> one pound, one pan, one taste meal. 
try to concentrate on keeping people healthy. Sickness in this game is one of the worst killers. Oh, definitely. Oh, it for sure is. Yeah, for sure. I think I'll, uh, I think I'll just go. Actually, no, let's, let, let's go with my gut. Six, uh, $690. We're going to buy these. And here we go, baby. Oh, I want to keep some oxen because we got to keep them moving. You know what I mean? But they also might eat a lot of grass this way. So rations are filling. Hang on. How do we, uh, filling large and generous meager meals, small, but adequate meals are very small. Everyone stays hungry and your health may suffer. Yeah. We're going to try our best to not do bare bones. What if we just went straight to meager meals? Would that be, is it too soon? We, I mean, we have 1,200 food. Maybe I'll cut, maybe I'll go down to meager later on, but uh, let's see. Our wagon weight is heavy, naturally. Okay. Our pace. Um, finish every day tired. Uh, you take many rests and rarely get very tired. Okay. So keep steady pace as long as possible. Better take extra sets of clothing. Trade them to Indians for fresh vegetables, fish, or meat. It's well worth hiring an Indian guide at river crossings. Expect to pay them. They're sharp traders, not easily cheated. Oh, <laughs> uh, wow. Okay. That was a guy named Jim. I'm missing your streams, Kirk. I got to get back in there. Um, Kirk's had to take a little break, but uh, keep an eye out. Keep an eye out. The OG game, OG game came out in 71. I thought it was released when I was a kid, but it was old even when I started playing it. Yeah, not easily cheated. All right, let's freaking do this. Let's leave. It is hot here. It is hot here. We traveled 21 miles in the first day. We have the Kansas River crossing coming up. Our pace is nice and steady. I don't know. I'm feeling good about this, my friends. I'm feeling good. And then can you just check the status whenever? Yeah, everybody's in good health. Okay. All right. How much food did we go through? We're already down to, uh, we, we ate 45 pounds of food. These, this is non-perishable food, by the way. Okay. So that is different then. That is different. Wonder what the squiggly boop blue poop was. That was the river. Yeah, it's the river. Poop. All right. We have arrived at the Kansas river crossing. Let's, uh, do we talk to somebody here? There is a guide. Kansas River is a tributary to the Missouri. It is approximately 170 miles long. Its width and depth vary depending on the amount of recent rain or snowmelt. Where the Oregon Trail crosses the Kansas River, the average width is 620 feet. The usual depth in the middle is about 4 feet. Be, but be sure to check the present conditions when you get there. Okay, do I do that just by uh, talking to somebody? Can't afford to take a ferry. We're making our wagon into a boat. We'll turn it over, caulk the bottom and sides with pitch. And use it to float our goods across. Have to swim the animals. Hope it doesn't rain. The river's high enough. Thank you, stranger. There is voice acting, but I feel like I might just read most of this stuff. Do you want to keep a particular pace? Not getting there fast enough brings heavier amounts of travel through the snow and cold, which will wear on the party. Yeah, especially as you're getting tired at the end, huh? I've been streaming because the house doesn't have AC except in my bedroom. I don't have space to put my setup, but I plan to get a laptop and capture card next month so I can do it for my PlayStation. In the meantime, we'll be streaming directly from the PlayStation. Just won't have my alerts or PNG for the time being. Between that and your job, it's been a lot, right? I know. We gotta get Kirk. We gotta get Kirk out of there, right? At least get him a. Uh, it'd be better if he had a a better um uh like landlord, you know? <laughs> right? I just like I feel like an a AC is a pretty uh a pretty reasonable ask in my mind. Voice acting is so funny though. It is, yeah. Are you at, are you at work now, Spooky? Did you make it? All right. Uh, so if I hit continue, is that going to give me the? Okay, yeah. All right. River at this point is currently six hundred and fifty-one feet across and eight point eight feet deep in the middle. Oh, jeez. The guy said he couldn't afford to take a ferry. It was just a stranger though. He's not part of my party. Oh. Took the meat spills out my hall. My hall. Oh, these blackings crawl. Crawl. Oh, ski, 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 ski. Oh, ski, ski. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, ski, 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 ski. Oh, ski, ski. Oh, man. Oh, man. 
It's the last day? And it's your boyfriend's last day at work, too? Oh, heck yeah. We'll party for that. Cheers. It's still so funny to me. Like, I know Spooky, like, so he's in the office. My company, uh, I got to turn all my crap in. My company um, always makes the last day a Thursday. They always have it be a Thursday. Incredibly rude to make you come in today. Yeah, I think so too. You should have collected all your crap yesterday and then you could have had today to like just do whatever. Yeah, our last days are Thursdays. Probably want to give them cake. Hopefully they do. Yesterday to go turn in, then let you free today. Huh. Um, all right, here we go. We have the explanation of river crossing methods too. To ford a river means you drive your ox and wagon across a shallow part of the river, which is not ideal in this case. To caulk the wagon means to seal with pitch of, or tar so that no water can get in. The wagon can be floated across the river like a boat. To take a ferry means you pull your wagon, you put your wagon on top of a flat boat that belongs to someone else. The owner of the ferry will charge a fee to take your wagon across the river. To hire a Native American guide means that you can give a Native American several sets of clothing to help you cross the river. To wait and see if conditions improve means to camp by the river and wait for the depth of the river to go down far enough that you can safely ford or talk your wagon and float across. Okay, so uh, is there like a button for music or something? I, okay, hang on. We're going to put our own music in here. I don't know if that's going to be uh, bad or what. Give me one second here. Can I? Hang on. We're, we're going to go here for just a second. Try not to, uh, uh, see if I can, uh, oh, that's not going to help, is it? Okay, never mind. Because we're playing this straight out of the browser. Okay, actually, I have an idea. Better give you a cake? I hope so. He deserves it. Let me get our own music playing here, though. All right, let me see if I can capture this a little bit better because right now it's being kind of a being a turd. Um, um oh. Jenny isn't here with me. Okay, this will be kind of interesting. Oh, come on, screen? Why is it doing it like that? Okay, that'll be fine. All right. Okay, good enough for me. Just testing some things out. Sorry, we're doing this kind of on the fly here. Okay. All right, this should be much better now. Okay. <laughs> All right. And I'm not even blocking. Uh, now you can see the whole screen. There we go. All right. Homeowner drives me nuts. He'll drive 10 extra miles to save two cents on gas. Oh, gosh. One of those, huh? Giving away my keys for work felt so darn good back in 2020. I'm leaving if they threw a party. What are they going to do? Fire you? Yeah, you wouldn't want a cake? Thank them for the cake. Pick up the whole thing and walk out. <laughs> well, he's going to pull a Homelander with the cake. It's good. Oh, gosh. Season four, boys. You know, I have not been watching season four yet. I wanted to rewatch uh, the other seasons. Also, are they releasing weekly? not watched Gen V or the new season. I haven't watched Gen V either. Gen V was actually really good. I heard good things about it. Uh, should I try to caulk, caulk the wagon and float it? Or wait, what if I take a... No, taking a ferry means I'm going to have to give up some of the clothes I've got. 
Um, it's 8.8 .8 feet deep in the middle. So if we if we flip, it's gonna be problem city here. But uh, but it seems like it's calm. So let's do this. We're amazing. We're all amazing. All right. Let's go ahead and continue on here. Also, now there's music playing. How do I turn the music off? Actually, I actually think I can do this. Loot's giving hot ma uh, male librarian vibes today, or welcome to the Apple Store. What are you looking for vibes? Uh, I don't know how I feel about that. Mixed feelings about that statement. I'm into a Battlestar Galactica rewatch now. Are you really? Oh, hell yeah. Okay, I got to turn the music off of this now because this is just silly. Oh, there we go. Okay, there's that. I'm going to turn up the sense of, no, turn down the sensitivity a little bit. There we go. Oh, that's 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 it right there. All right. Perfect. Although wait, why is that? There we go. Okay, still have the options on the side there. All right. Now we're in business. We're playing this game middle school in the computer lab, right? Yeah. Boys be buoyant. Hey, Sandoval, good morning. Recommend Gen V binge and, binge and wait for all season four to be done. Yeah, okay, so it's a weekly release, and I agree. I would also like to wait till it, it's fully uh, fully released. Bought the complete original series. I should give it a go. One of the main guys died RL. It was sad. I'm talking about this is Battlestar Galactica. I forgot how well made it was, to be honest. I feel like we got spoiled with it. All right, the Big Blue River Crossing. Big Blue River. I feel like I've seen that in real life. All right, let's... I don't need to talk to anybody here. It's just going to be some random dude again. Um, oh, also, my wagon weight is heavy. I think we'll caulk this one, too. This one is is uh, less deep and also only 253 feet across. I think we'll do that. Much love to you, Sandval. How's your weekend looking? Come on, baby! The weather is clear and nice, and this is a smaller river. Let's go. Let's go. All right. And continue on again. It is April 10th. We left on April 1st. We are fools. Always had great dealings with our local store. Some of the Apple store people are fine. Went through all that with the music and you're turning it off immediately. Yeah. Yeah. You guys can hear you guys can hear other music though, right? I mean, it's not just I just the game music is just I don't know. It's too uh I just don't know what I'm gonna get, you know? Oh, in Gen V, it's sad too because his character is really great. Really? Love these old retro games. Takes me back, right? Right? Uh, I'm going to be retiring from my old job. I'm going to get to a new one. I don't have a manager. I'll just have my own business cutting hair. Oh, that's very cool, Sandoval. Today's your last day of your old job. Well, awesome. We got three people having their last day at their old job. Spooky, Sandoval, and uh, Mr. Blue Seals. Fort Kearney. What if I talk to somebody here? All right, let's listen to this guy. Oh, I muted this. Well, I muted the sound, so I, I didn't realize. It's not just a music. It's it's all game sound. <laughs> the game is still plentiful along here, but getting harder to find with so many overlanders. I don't expect it to last more than a few years. Folks shoot the game for sport, take a small piece, and let the rest rot in the sun. Oh, that's not me. Don't you worry, my friend. It is getting kind of cool, though, huh? Uh, let's see. Is there... If I hit continue, do I just leave the fort? Oh, I can buy stuff here. There we go. Okay. I have a hundred... Wait, how do I have a hundred and... Oh, that's right. I put some stuff back. Okay. I feel like we should probably spend more of it. And all of this is, is a higher cost than the beginning. I think I want to spend some of it on pounds of food, huh? Um, and then I don't know how many oxen we want to have. Uh, at one point in the game, the more oxen you had, the faster the the uh, the wagon moved. I don't know if that's the case in the original. Well, this isn't the original original, but I don't know if it's the case in this version of the game. I think Spooky should be Mr. Unhinged. 
What a day, uh, what a club to join. Maybe someday, right? The the last the last day of work club. So progressive of him. Since Discord nick nickname unchange uh, change in three, two. He well he, right now he's Mr. Unfortunate Nipples, which I think was I don't know if he actually changed his name or if that was um Octi that did that, but let's buy another Wait a minute. Why can't I type here? Okay, this is weird. I cannot type right now. I cannot type. That could be a problem. Hmm. Mr. Unhinged Nipples. And his nipples are so cute and normal. <laughs> they are normal. I, um, I, it's just, uh, yeah. What, why did, why did the, uh, the whole, like, um, low nipples thing start? I don't even remember. Numlock? Um, this is a, uh, this is a 10 keyless keyboard, so I don't even have a numlock button. Um, uh, I'm not sure what's going on. It was loose con? Wait, really? Poro thought they were low. Wait, but you saw him at Lutzcon? How did you see him at Lutzcon and I didn't? Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> uh, rarely use Discord because all the white dots drive my OCD crazy. Not just in yours, but all the Discords I'm in. When I do go in and see everyone's changed their names, I'm like, I don't know who this is. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's um pretty uh pretty uh pretty hard to keep up with everything. You can't at least click and see their original name. Um, okay, so I'm going to just click cancel. And then if I click buy, let's try to come back to it. Nope. Um, okay. Hang on. Let me escape this. Okay, let's try this. We added the virtual keyboard that my cursor doesn't go on. Let's try it anyway, though. If we hit escape. No, even that's not working. Okay, the game is just straight up bugged. Oh, God. It is. Okay, so even the virtual keyboard is not. It's not doing anything. Okay. All right. Cool game. Very, very cool. Very cool. Very cool. Very cool. Tight, 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 tight. Cool, 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 cool. No, this is fine. This is fine. We don't need any food anyway. Screw it. Screw it. We don't want your dang food, Fort Kearney. We don't want your dang food anyway. An ox wandered off for two days. Oh, come on. Oro. This was your job. This was your job. You're on oxen duty. <sighs> A fire. Guys, what are we doing? What are we doing? Who is sabotaging the party? Ursa, did you do this? Were you Surprise, just motherfucker? Were you trying to light a cig? We said no smoking in the wagon, ten feet from the exit of the wagon. We lost five. How the frick did we lose five bullets from that? Three wagon. That's all of our wagon axles. We lost two wagon tongues and seven hundred. No, no, no. That's not even. That's just cooked food at this point, isn't it? Needed her opium. <laughs> That's some good weed at the last fort, okay? Were we freaking holding out? We couldn't do anything. Now my wagon weight is light because we're about to die. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and hunt. I, I, I'm going to hunt here. We need we need to get some food. All right. I don't remember uh, the bullet lag on this, so I'll have to get kinda caught up on that. I know the bullets come in from an angle. Okay, we got that. And that's actually enough, isn't it? Used eight bullets. Okay. Oh, we actually got 200 pounds. We had, uh, okay. Freaking rabbits. What happened? He was smoking. I think it was Ursa. I think it was Ursa. Oro's letting our oxen wa wander off and spooky. Freaking spooky. I think what happened here is we told spooky that, hey, we're going to have to go on a jog. And spooky's like, let me just jump off the back of this wagon. I'd rather break my leg then go for a run um, to go catch any food. Spooky's just being dramatic. Oh my god. This escalated so quickly. This was just like 
real conversations I had, <laughs> not the real life deep cut. <laughs> Hey, Spooky, hey, we're, we're going to go catch some game over here. We got to do a little jogging, though. You up for it? Oh, yeah, definitely, dude. Jumps from the top rope. Oh, my gosh. All right. Uh, we, we probably... Do we need to rest? Wagon weight is middling. Hang on a second. Do we need to rest here? Is there a pause on this game? Yo, Sorty, how you doing? Party's having serious issues. I know, right? Uh, Hang on. Let's look. Where's the status button? There it is. Okay. Lutz, good. Coleman, good. Ursa, good. Koro, good. Spooky, broken leg. Fantastic. This is going great. I'm glad. I'm glad we could. We're a quarter of the way there. Timeout pauses. Wait, timeout? Oh, timeout pauses. Okay, I gotcha. Uh, 14 pounds of food due to spoilage. That's actually not too bad. I thought we were going to lose a lot more than that, if we're being honest. Um. <clears throat> Cora was over here. We're trying to con convince Cora to eat more food, but she's over here still grazing like a like a little rabbit. And we're like, Cora, this is the Oregon Trail. You have to actually eat. And so we had to throw out 14 pounds of her food. Coleman over here has just been an angel. He's been he's been playing cards the whole time. He's been playing cards the whole time. He's been trying to teach us about this new like. He's like, dude, some of these cards are gonna become collectible one day. And we're like, what the frick are you talking about? Spooky's over here. Broken leg. Chimney Rock. Okay, is there anybody here? I hear about terrible stories about wagon parties running out of food before Oregon. The whole party's starving to death. We must check our supplies often. We might not get there as soon as we think. Always plan for the worst, I say. Well, thank you, Rebecca Sims. Mercy, how you doing? Also, I, that was you with the surprise, wasn't it? Holy poop, that crew, I'm dying. <laughs> Not Coleman carrying the whole team, just like Sea of Thieves. He hasn't been doing squat, yeah. I don't want to have a tummy ache. Sorty, how's your how's your weekend looking, dude? Broken leg means more time for Lord of the Rings Magic the Gathering. It's true. It is true. Although, is he still? Yeah, he's still got a broken leg. Do we need to rest? We're probably fine to keep going, right? It's just a broken leg. Then again, broken legs are kind of deadly, so... Uh, he's got good rations. We've been resting plenty. Maybe we need to rest. Let's rest. Uh, let's rest two days. Oh yeah, I can't type. I can't type. Oh, we're on. We're on this. Um, I keep forgetting. Yeah, I can't. I can't type in this thing. This. This. The game is like just totally busted right now. Is there any other way I could put a two in that box? I don't think so. Okay. Raw. Yeah, we're just raw dogging the Oregon Trail. Oh, here we go, everybody. I can hunt. Um, I can choose options with my mouse. But there is no input whatsoever. Lady has a voice actor that sounds like my mom. Oh, amazing. Broken wagon tongue. Do you want to spend a day trying to fix it? See, this is what I can do. I can do that. You fix the broken wagon tongue. Now, how many do I have? Uh, I have one, one tongue, uh, no axles. I do have three wheels, though, for what it's worth. Okay. I wish I wish there was just like a what if there was a button here that just like it was a counter and you could increase food is running low it's true yeah food is running low um should we hunt here let's hunt here this is a great place to hunt I'm not even going to try to go for rabbits I'm just going to wait oh shoot that deer just totally dodged me if we get two deer or one bison we're good or like a gazelle are they gazelles also can you hunt is it is it on a timer? I really don't remember this. Come on, I don't want any squirrels. I don't want your squirrels. Stop it. Just stop. I'm literally only going for gazelle. Okay, that freaking A, man. Freaking A. No bison over here, I guess. Come on! I might have to go for rabbits. There aren't enough gazelle to go around. There we go. Okay, we got one. All right. Oh, there's birds too. Oh, shoot. Okay. Yeah, 27 pounds? No, come on. That was not... that. 27 pounds? Are you kidding me? Also, where did my wagon go? 
My wagon's gone. Okay, it's back. Don't worry. Not breaking legs and not dying. The bar is real low. Who's about to starve because he's picky? It's true. A freaking another broken wagon tongue? Dude, did I not fix it good enough the first time? Oh my gosh. We have a hundred and... Okay, we're going to... Sorry, guys. We're going to have to have that talk. It's time to eat less food. Buki still hasn't recovered from his broken leg. Fort Laramie. Let's see if maybe this ma magically works now. Magically. Nope, it sure doesn't. I, what am I supposed to do? Poor and Spooky drove the wagon off. They were too busy smooching. Versus set on fire. I, I don't know that... Yeah, I'm using arrow keys, but like those... It's got to have like a number. And you can see how my cursor is kind of like twitching like that. It's like it wants to type, but it just won't focus. I'm like rapid fire clicking and pressing the mouse at the same time but it's like it i don't know it's like it won't gather the focus um did i try i did try it on not full screen right yeah it's just the game it's just the game all right we'll just keep going we'll just keep going i just clicked buy i don't know Able to type before? I did. Yeah, I typed everybody's name in at the beginning. Tab back out and uh, out and back in. I tried that too. Um, let me see if I could maybe change the window real quick and then go back to it. I think I... Did I minimize this screen before? Try that. Yeah. This won't work. Kind of sucks. We're on a We're on a bit of a suicide mission here. Nander's going to lose his mind with that truck sim video. Wait, what? What's this? Sad, say, sad, sage, we're all dead. Sad, we're all dead, though. Don't let Spooky drive because he uses both feet. Yeah. I, I I learned. I learned. Unfortunately. Unfortunately. Oh, wait a minute. Why is this brown now? Hey, Pocket Ninja. How you doing? I don't have a numpad. Yeah, I got asked about if I had like num lock or anything. But this this keyboard's a 10 kilo, so it doesn't even have a num lock. All right, let's try to hunt here. Ursa has cholera. Can I read about cholera? Is there anything specific about cholera? Right here. Cholera is caused by a bacterial infection of the small intestine acquired from contaminated food or water. Its symptoms include severe diarrhea, vomiting, muscle cramps, and weakness. If left untreated, its victims can quickly become dehydrated, go into a coma, and die. It's vital that patients rest and replace the water and salt they've lost. Recovery takes place within two to seven days. Hang on, is a broken leg in here? I don't see a broken leg. No, no broken legs. Wait, maybe, could it be something else? How long is it supposed to take for this dang leg to repeat uh, to heal, recover? Forget this game has a codex because education. All right, well we're gonna try. I mean I can't rest. That's the thing. I can't rest. But um, what I can do? Let's take a time out. I can hunt. I can hunt here. Oh, I can't. Well, it's at night still. Okay, hunt here. Okay, food is ninety one. Oh, there's not gonna be much here. There is not going to be much here. Oh, man. These bullets are slow AF. Oh, that hit. Come on, game. Come on, game. Give me something. There we go. We got to get at least something here. Oh, come on. These are hits. I'm telling... Well, that one wasn't. That was a fast bird, and it's dead now. Okay. Okay. Okay, well, five pounds. We killed like four birds and a rabbit and we got five pounds. I don't think this is, I don't think that's how that works. I don't think that's how that works. Then again, this maybe, maybe they don't have GMOs in them. I guess maybe they don't. Time to diaper Ursa. 
Why is it so upsetting for a fella to drive the two with two pedals with his two feet? <laughs> oh, I don't know, Spooky. I don't know. Oh, heavy fog. Lose one day. Perfect. That's perfect, actually. Our rations are going to have to go bare bones. Right, we're going to die. We're definitely going to die. This is one of those where you can see it coming, but there's nothing you can do to stop it. I just cannot believe our wagon got caught on fire and we lost 747 pounds. Makes me want to play RDR2, which we have been. You just mean like quit right now so you can go play? Oh, yeah, I forgot. You could add to this journal, too. I should have added to the journal. That would be good to look back on for posterity. Hang on. If I, I scrolled up in the journal, okay. A fire in our wagon. A fire? Oh, yeah, I can't type. That's right. I was going to try to type here, but... Oh, that just brought up this menu. File. Name. Wait. Oh, I could change the hunt time? Yeah, that's not going to happen. Okay. All right. Well, let's just keep it going. We're about to run out of food, even using uh, meager rations. We're kind of in the uh, the dead zone here of of uh, let me I gotta I gotta try hunting again. There's no no other way I can get any food. Oh, that was a gazelle or something. Oh, I clicked I clicked off the screen. There we go. Okay, watch that's gonna be about. 10 pounds. I gotta, I gotta use these bullets. I'm firing indiscriminately now. There we go. Okay, we got three gazelle things. Is there even, is it even worth it shooting a squirrel? 66. Okay, that'll, that'll last us at least. Shooting so much. I am, yeah, I'm impatient. I'm impatient. You can eat my diseased body. Must have sent you the wrong link for Oregon Trail from what I used. Uh... Oh, I was. Oh, now Coro has col a cholera. Thanks so much. Thank you so much, Ursa, for sharing that. Thank you so much. Spooky is well again. It only took him four weeks to heal his broken leg, and Ursa's well. Heck yeah! How are you getting well when we're? Oh, because the pace. That's why. Oh yeah, we gotta we gotta increase this pace, everybody. We gotta go at a grueling pace. All right. We got places to be. All right, we're at Independence Rock. I really wish I could buy something. Uh, you're going to kill Koro. <laughs> I'm going to die. He's like, get the heck out of here. My leg. Koro ate the leg. Have I done anything of note? You have not done a thing, Coleman. Not done a thing. You've been like making some doodles. We had we had a pack of trading cards, or not trading cards, but playing cards. We've been making uh, you've been you've been doodling on these on these playing cards. I mean, like someday, there's gonna be a game where there are these pictures just like this, and uh, you've been trying to convince us to buy them from you, but uh, we don't know what that's going on. Not now. <laughs> Boros pooping down her leg. Um, all right. Well, we'll try it. We'll go, we'll go, we'll go at a strenuous pace. How's that? Um, someone give me a this or that icebreaker for my work meeting. A this or that? I can think he's been carrying the whole family. Maybe he nursed everybody back to health. Man, it would be great if I could buy something. Oh, wait, I could trade. Hang on. That's a clicking thing, isn't it? Nope. Nope. It sure isn't. It's still a typing thing. Man, this game was not accessible. Imagine that. Imagine that. Um, hmm. I think it needs the numpad. It shouldn't. It shouldn't. It worked just fine at the beginning when I bought stuff at the store. The very first store, but then it just stopped working after that. Uh, let's see. What kind of stuff could we drop? I couldn't even drop stuff if I needed to drop weight. Couldn't even do it. Okay, well, here we go. Yeah, I don't think there's any reason to not travel at a grueling pace now that I now that I think of it. I think we just got to go for it. Our health is poor. Oh, wait. What is our status now? Everybody is poor. Rations are bare bones. Pace is grueling. Game from 1995. It's a miracle it works at all. 
<laughs> 10 key dominance. Yeah, I'm, I'm using the 10 key list, but like I said, it is not that. It's 100% not that because I, I typed numbers in when I bought my initial goods. My well, last one was if you could live inside a Disney file, which one would you pick? A Disney film. Okay. Hmm. Um. Would you rather have hands for feet or feet for hands? That's a dumb question. Everybody would try to choose hands for feet. Um, I don't, I don't know. That'd be a good one. We're not, we're about halfway there. We're all going to die too. Like this isn't just a Koro's about to die thing. This is everybody's about to die. South pass. Let's, let's freaking continue. Uh, we can't buy any supplies anyway, so let's go, uh, let's take the shortcut. Also, my music stopped. Give me one sec here. A useless fact. People can walk on hands, but feet don't have thumbs. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, everybody would choose that. Been wanting to try uh, to play the new Oregon Trail reboot, but the graphics are almost too nice. I actually thought you were playing the updated one. Wait, who? I, how have we not died yet? I'm kind of trying to speed run our death so that we can I can kill this one and see if maybe we can we can get the keyboard to work. Uh, time is 9:28. Okay. Uh, here's your useless fact. There's a house in New Jersey built in the shape of an elephant, a house in Oklahoma shaped like a chicken, and a house in Massachusetts made entirely of newspapers. No idea if that's still the case. Uh, this book is 12 years old, but there you go. Those are three states in the United States. Um. So there you go. Throwing us into the meat grinder, myself included. I should I should clarify. Myself included. Kufu butt hasn't killed me yet. Not yet. You loots, I thought you were gonna be booting up the version Spooky was talking about. Oh, the newest version? Uh no, I had to play. This is the simulacre. We gotta play the old version. Green River Crossing. Uh 41 feet deep. I think we should try to ford this baby. What do you guys think? At least hunt till we're out of bullets. Okay, I can do that. 41 feet deep, 400 feet across. This sounds like a Ford attempt if I've ever heard of one. <laughs> oh, you have a call, Nonder? No, oh, you should quit too. An Oregon trail run? I forgot the Friday theme. What if we could survive at this point? It'd be so impressive to make it when the game is pooping on us. That would be pretty funny, yeah. Can't believe you're gonna use the water to kill me. <laughs> Hang on, let's try to hunt in the area. Near the river might be a good place to hunt. Spooky's got a good idea. We should try to just hunt. Um, can't hunt at landmarks because there are too many people around. Ah, forget people, man. Forget people. Okay, we gotta, we gotta try. We gotta try to survive here. We have clothing. We might as well just go ahead and take the ferry. Charge you five dollars that we have to wait three days. We we have we cannot wait. We can absolutely cannot wait. Uh, actually, no, we can. That'll count as rest, won't it? Let's try it. That's the only way I can rest, in fact, um, because I don't have um, didn't have the food to wait. Yeah, that's the problem. I don't. All right, we're gonna try to hunt Koro's well again. I don't know how that's possible, but that is good with me. Okay. Oh, this is a good place to hunt, right? There's some greenery. <gasps> we just got 200 pounds of food. Okay, we can have uh, we can have meager meals now. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Our health is still poor. You lost the trail for five days, Pullman. You are my navigator. You know this. How did you let this happen to us? Things were going great. Shooting more buffalo than ease. I couldn't remember. I wanted to make sure I got 200 exactly. And I couldn't remember if they were like 190 pounds. How is it my fault? You are our navigator. I'm a blacksmith. I don't know how to read. Especially in, I don't know how to read a map. I don't. I can't even look at pictures. You're the brains of this operation. 20 pounds of food due to spoilage. Come on. Come on. We were, we were doing well here for a second. We lost the trail for five freaking days. We're still on a grueling pace, by the way. Um, our health is fair. We lost another day to fog. All right, Mother Nature just totally screwing us here. We found some wild fruit. Let's go. 
We're just going to put random random berries in our mouths. It's fine. Fine. An ox is sick. That's fine. We got 11 more. Should I slow it down a little bit? Spooky was bitten by a snake. Spooky. Dude. I don't know what you were thinking about that there. We tried to tell you. He was going over there. He's like, he's like, lol, there's a snake in my boot. But he wasn't kidding. We thought he was just joking around like, okay, spooky. All right. There's a snake in my boot. Bit right in my broken leg, Marrow. <laughs> Too busy looking at his cards. Yeah, he was just, just looking at cards. Wash the filth off in the water. Playing with the snake again. <laughs> Rip spooky indeed. He's the blacksmith, i.e. picks things up and puts them down. Occasionally hits a thing or two. Yeah, I'm the wagon fixer. All right. More 12 more pounds of food due to spoilage. Okay. Should we slow down a little bit? Let's do a strenuous pace instead. Wait, what is this coming up? Is, th is this an ambush? Somebody pretending to get water? It's also getting hot, so maybe if we can slow it down a little bit, that will help. Found some more wild fruit. How much like how much food does that add? Does that add any food to our, our stores? Okay, this is Soda Springs. That's good, right? Uh can you buy it? What is what is the point of this area? Do we just talk to somebody? I've heard it said that there are many cutoffs to taking to take to shorten the journey. That by taking all the shortcuts, you can save many days on the trail. And why not? Saving time and provisions is worth the risk. Is it? Lutes poor, Coleman poor, spooky snake bite, Ursa poor, Coro poor. Okay. Was he even trying to learn anything or the lore? What do you mean? If I hit the guide, will that tell me? Soda Springs is an important landmark and stopping off point along the trail. It gets its name from the alkaline, sodium, mineral springs you find there. Some, some travelers separate from the Oregon Trail at this point and head southwest to California. Others wait until they get to Fort Hall before going on the California Trail. We're on the Oregon Trail. Is the pace too... Okay, maybe we need a steady pace to try to get our, our health back up. I just really wish I could rest, but I can't. Can't do it. We can't do it. But at least maybe the steady pace will bring our health back up. If you open the notepad and type your numbers, can you copy and paste into the shop? Ooh, that's a great question. Let me try that. Let's get to this fort and I'll try that. I'm getting back down under 100 pounds of food. Game is the greatest cultural contribution the state of Minnesota has ever made. It was made in Minnesota? I mean, the voice acting makes sense, but... I asked if you could copy-paste. You did? Oh. Well, I, I only read Ursa, so therefore Ursa gets all the credit. And all of my love. It's true, I saw that. Coleman standing up for Koro? Oh my goodness. Okay, give me one sec. I'll try it. Notepad. Let's type the number... Uh, We have enough... We, can we buy, like... How much food can I buy? I guess let's let's see how much food they have before we uh try that here. Okay. Uh we had we still have 12 oxen. One of them is sick. Hopefully we won't get all the rest. Oh man, this stuff is getting expensive and scarce. Okay. Let's see. I can't even afford can't even afford. No, I can. What am I thinking? I'm gonna buy them out of food here. If it'll let me. 75 is the number I need. 75. I can't imagine this is going to work, but uh, but it's worth a shot. Worth a shot. Nope. Not working. Developer Mech is the Minnesota Educational Computing Consortium. What? Uh, wow. Okay, that's also a pretty high and mighty name. But uh, she said copy pasta. Rub my dysentery in your gruel loots. Wait, you're aren't you well? You don't even have any dysentery to rub in here. Look, it's only Spooky that's got a snake bite. I don't know. I mean, we don't know what's going to happen with him. He's just sort of like, ah, it's fine. It'll be fine. I do need to hunt again, though. I say so. <laughs> Not many. There was a paste option. Okay, we'll try. We'll try. Yeah, I don't I don't think it's going to work. I think that's part of, like, the, the DOS box here that's running on, but I don't. 
Is there... Yeah, even the shortcut is grayed out. I don't think we can do it. I don't think we can do it, unfortunately. Uh, so, therefore, we must continue on. And then I'm going to try to hunt. Yeah, that's a good area to hunt. Okay, hopefully we just get one bison this time. Or do we go for these? Beggars can't be choosers. That's an actual deer. Oh, there's a bison. Okay. Oh, it freaking left so quick, though. Oh, shoot. I think I killed... Okay, crap. I killed too, way too much. Way too much. But we did get 200 more pounds of food. That's going to be that's gonna be real big for us going at this slow weight here. Or slow speed. Rough trail. Okay. Oh, gosh. I'm gonna break a I'm gonna break a wagon wheel, aren't I? I can repair stuff though. I can repair stuff. I'm a blacksmith. Okay, as soon as our health gets back up to good and spooky's good, I'm gonna pick up the pace here. I'm gonna pick up the pace. Oh, I need to continue. Spooky is well again. Okay. That's part one. Now we need everybody to be to go from health. Well, our health probably isn't going to improve until we have more generous rations, will it? My man, no grass for the oxen. Fantastic. 21 pounds of food due to storage. Fantastic. Thanks for the good news. We're like two thirds of the way to the trail. This is somehow looking possible. Not probable, but possible. No grass. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Our ox are going to start dropping like flies now, aren't they? If you stop asking Spooky to get off the wagon, he wouldn't get injured. <laughs> Spooky, just please be a layabout. No grass. Yep. Yep. No grass. No grass. How many times do you think we'll have no grass along here? All right. Let's try one more hunt. This area looks pretty promising. I do actually really like the pixel colors they use here. They use purple, which you may not expect. Okay, that... How are deer... Like, they? how do they dodge these? Ooh, that's a big boy. Okay. That's probably enough, right? What are these creatures? 713... Holy crap. Okay, those creatures are freaking stacked. What, what are those? Were they elk? Must have been elk, huh? I'm back. Who got eaten? So far, if you can believe it, everybody's alive. Them's elks. Them's there's elks. Uh, you know what? Took the wrong trail and lost one day. Coleman at it again. All right, I am gonna give us better, better. Uh, I gotta try to get our health back up while we have some food. So we're gonna give filling portions. Go at a steady pace. I'm trying to get our health back up. Snake River Crossing. Spooky. Be careful around here. Okay. Spooky is having a rough time. We are bouncing, but look at the status here, though. Everybody is in fair health. Everybody's in spare he a fair health right now, and we got a decent amount of food. I'm going to bite that river. <laughs> Payback, baby. All right. It is hot conditions because it is July 5th. Oh, we just missed Independence Day. Brick. We did not even commemorate it at all. We actually took the wrong trail and lost a, lost a day on the 4th of July. Uh, 12 feet deep in the middle. Okay, we can caulk this. This is 1,000 feet across? Hire a Native American to help? They'll want clothing. Wait, how many? Hang on. How, how many clothings do we have? We still have. Ooh, we only have 10 sets of clothing still. Okay. If somebody ends up going naked here, that's going to be really bad. So I don't think I want to give up any clothing. I I was honestly kind of banking on buying clothing later or trading for it or something. But my key, you know, my keyboard not working. That's not going to be it. Um, well, we can't afford it. 12 feet's too deep. The berries either add to food or offsets food costs for a day. Okay. Snake River, yeah, a thousand feet across is uh is bad. I'll hang hog to survive. <laughs> Yeehaw. Actually doing blooding amazing for not being able to type on numbers. I'm really like I'd feel so good about this if we could just put in freaking numbers. Um man. Do you guys think it'll dry up? Do you think there's any chance it'll dry up more than 12 feet? Because I would love to ford this. If it got down to like three feet, I would love to ford this. But um, I don't think it's going to happen. That's a significant drop off. I think we'd have to either hire or or a caulk. Hire the guy. Clothing only really matters if we're facing cold weather. So if we go naked, we're, we're fine. Well, how many clothing? How many pieces of clothing is he going to ask for? 
two sets of clothing. A Shoshone guide says that he will take your wagon across the river in exchange for two sets of clothing. Uh, that's a steal. That's a steal. We'll do it. This river is just way too long. Otherwise, a thousand feet was very concerning for me. Thank you, Mr. Shoshone. Higher person, but I don't know much about the game. Well, uh, two of us lost our extra sets of clothing. And um, Pookie volunteered. I also volunteered. So, so we, we're down to one. Oh, bad water. Oh, frick. Somebody's getting sick, aren't they? Somebody's going to get sick. Come on, I'm trying to get our health back up to good. Hoochie to the max, yep. <laughs> it is Hoochie Daddy Summer after all. I mean, Smoochie Daddy Summer. So in this case, probably just, just Hoochie. Uh, there's nothing much else I can do. The bad water gauntlet, yeah. No grass and bad water. 26 pounds of food due to spoilage, okay. We might go back to meager here pretty soon. Once we get down to like 150 food, we're going to go back to meager. But we're trying to give him rest. Which one has syphilis? Oh, gosh. Hog hanging summer, baby. If Spooky gets sick, I swear. Broken wagon tongue. Do you want to spend a day trying to fix it? Yes. Couldn't fix the wagon tongue, but you replaced I couldn't? I'm a blacksmith. That's the whole point. Now I'm letting us down. No water. Not even bad water. Just no water. Okay. We got to go. Yeah, we're going to have to go down to the... And ox died. Brick! Can we use it? We shroots use the whole ox. We gotta go back to meager. Our health went to poor. I don't know why. Oh, because of the no, the no water thing. We gotta go back down to meager, unfortunately, friends. I'm sorry. Fort Boise. Eat the ox. Time to eat it. I didn't have a choice. I would have. It, it, how, how kind of funny, sad would it have been if it said food left, 168, and ox died, food left, 368. You know what I mean? Like... Man. Uh, we've reached Fort Boise. Uh, do they let us buy anything? Oh, okay. Really steep prices, but they actually have more food. Still can't buy anything, though. We got to try. I mean, it's it's one of those things. We got to try. I think we're going to hunt on the other side of this. How many bullets do I have? Uh, bullets. 131? Oh, frick. We're doing fine on bullets. This game is super harsh. It is. Yeah, finding the berries has definitely been helpful. We need to beat, beat me like one of your beehives and making this a thing. <laughs> what? What what does that even mean? All right, let's hunt on the other side of this baby. Okay. We got it. We got to keep the hunting up. What is this? Is that a bear? Bear have got to be more than 200 pounds, right? Or is that a bear? Oh, I had just enough. To, okay, so each of the those are those can't be bear, right? Unless they're babies. A hundred pounds for a bear? That is not a that is not much of a not much. Oh, boar? That's a bear. Or those must have been baby bears. Blue shot a bear. Got lucky. A hundred pounds? Like that ain't that is nothing for. Uh, go back to our filling meals. Okay. And we're still doing, we're doing this thing. How did we just got food? We lost 35 more pounds. The, the Berenstain murders. Isn't it Berenstain bears? I have not been able to get our health back up from fair, even at this slower pace. The temp is hot. The problem is we haven't, I don't know about the food or the, the water situation. We've been drinking straight out of the river. Um, and, uh, I don't know. It just, it's been making us not feel too great. Not feeling too great. Our tummies are a little, a little upset. So, is that a tiger? Is that a piglet? Coro is suffering from exhaustion. Coro, how? How? We're we're taking this as slow as possible. Coro, I think you're just being a little dramatic. I think you're just being a little bit dramatic. It's very in character. <laughs> Listen, it will always be Berenstain. I refuse to accept this reality forced upon me. Oh, Berenstain. Stein? How did you say it? Stein? Steen? It actually is spelled S-T-A-I-N. I'm pretty sure. Baron Stein. Which is, like, kind of silly. An ox is sick. We're about to lose another ox. Okay. poro has been suffering from exhaustion. What's well, too damn bad! We can't rest! 
We taking it slow though. I mean, so we are getting rest in here. Steen, you say Steen. Rough trail ahead. All right. Turn me into a glue trap. <laughs> if this kills me, that would be so funny. We are so freaking close to the end here. I cannot believe it. I really thought that we would have had, like, at this point, maybe one of us alive. And I think the game, the game, Coleman has cholera. Freaking A. You'd hunt again? Actually, that'd be a good idea. Uh, that'd be a really good idea. It's nighttime, though. Okay, let's try hunting. Oh, man, this area is great. Coleman has poo-poo butt. Little poo-poo butt. All right, there's one bear cub. Uh, there's a... Something else. Those are deer. Uh, they're so freaking fast. All right. Okay. That should be enough, right? Just in case. We have tons of bullets. I feel bad. 325 pounds, but I didn't know if it'd be enough or not. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> All these men who lost their wives on the trail and have to turn, turn to our film. <laughs> Loose mate, you need to rethink your teammates. I... Oregon, wait, what? Ursa, what in the world? Decimating the local wildlife. I know, I know. I didn't like it either, but I didn't know. I don't know how much the deer weigh. Captions and everything. Like a three frame per second slideshow. We're back down to bad water, so we're still not going to heal up. No water, so we're going to get even worse. All right, we're almost to this mountain, which looks promising. Spooky. Ugh. Listen, Lutz, it's Spooky's idea. <laughs> Old timey film camera needs someone to crank it so we can sell the footage in Oregon for others to crank it. <laughs> Spooky's kept core up too late every night. I know because I watch. Oh my gosh. I've missed a lot of chat, I guess. Woman is cholera. Coro is sick. Spooky's just falling apart. Yeah, Coleman. Coleman still got cholera. Um, I think he'll be okay. We're all poor right now, though, so maybe he won't be okay. Coro's got exhaustion. We look. We've been going at a. We've been having filling rations uh, and steady pace, and we've got a good amount of food. Like we've been doing all the right things, you know. And I would do a trade here if I could, but I can't. Grande Ronde. That's definitely how it's pronounced, right? Uh, definitely going to pronounce, let me pronounce this in, uh, in early settler here. The grand, grandy Rondi is a river that runs roughly parallel to the blue mountains. The Oregon trail crosses through the, I'm going to go <laughs> Ariana Grande, Ariana Grande, Rondé mountains, the Grande Rondé river Valley, just before the mountains, the Grande Rondé Valley is noted for its beauty and is greatly appreciated by immigrants as a sign that their long journey is nearing its end. Is it though? Is it though? What's going on, Spoogs? How you doing? I know being poor was a health. I didn't know being poor was a health condition. I've been sick for years. This is still the same run. If you can believe this, you're so locked in on surviving this run. It's so funny. I was ready to, to speed run us to our deaths, but again, we can't buy any supplies, so we need to take the shortcut. Uh, so if you're it, Spoogs, we we have no input on this game. Like I cannot type numbers. Uh, there's some sort of glitch going on. So I, I cannot do any trading. I can't do any buying. I can't even do any resting. Uh, so I'm I'm limited exclusively to mouse input at this. Um, and we surprisingly have not had anybody die yet. Although I have a feeling at least one of them is coming here. Because we just haven't been able to get any grass or water here. Uh, grass for the ox. No water for us. Coro's well again though. Okay. Okay. All right, come on, Coleman. You gotta, you gotta freaking heal up now. How sad would it be if Coleman did like Coleman had nothing go wrong until the very end, and then he dies. More bad water. That's not helping Coleman's cholera. She was faking it. I know. I know. Well, 
Coleman carries the whole team to die right at the finish line. Pretty much. Pretty much. Um, at least you got to see Ariana Grande live. Coleman seriously had nothing happen until like right at the end. We have all this food. We're moving at a steady pace with, with generous rations. And he still got sick and died. I don't know. I mean, what more could we have done? His watch has ended. I have no navigator. We're definitely going off course now, too. Let's gather around and sing, Oh, Canada. He wasn't even... <laughs> he wasn't... <laughs> he wasn't meant for this land. <laughs> you guys got killed me for being mad at, for losing the trail. It was... It, it, honestly, in Coleman's defense, he is Canadian. And we shouldn't have expected him to know the, way, the layabouts of America. You know what I mean? It's really not his fault. I think Koro did. I think Coleman and Spooky were getting just a little bit too comfy one night. And Koro's like, listen, I'm not taking any chances. Um, and, uh, and, and unfortunately, I think what happened was, is like Koro had been slipping a little something into his food every night. Just a little something. So like, it, it was sort of like, oh, he just naturally got sick because of the water. But like, I think what really happened was it was Koro just slowly but surely killing him. Let's piece this together. Coral miraculously recovers and Coleman dies. I know, right? Is it a Sleeping Beauty situation? Try kissing the corpse. <laughs> I'm dying. This is the best. Get ready entertainment. Or dysentery. Some of my leftover dysentery. Weird. Where did all of our glue go? <laughs> Coral ate his heart and gained his strength. That's the only logical conclusion. Yeah. Bad water uh, equals poison. Wait. Minus equals poison? Which? Which Coleman, I, I am truly sorry. I really do not think you deserve that at all. We are so close to the end of this trail too, but like he basically died on the stretch run here. No grass for the oxen. We're in fair health. Should we just speed run to the end? No, I don't want to get greedy. I don't want to get greedy. We got 200 pounds of food. We should be fine. I don't want to get greedy here. I think we have one more stop. An ox died. 196 food. We're down to 10 oxen. Our food did not increase. I think that's kind of crap, if I'm being honest. Minus was typo. I was like, hang on. Minus equals is actually... Um, that is actually a uh, a computation in uh, in code. So I didn't know. And Nander's now a professional coder, so I didn't know. Watch us fall like dominoes before the end. The fact that you can only click OK is so funny to me. Yeah, it's like... An ox died. Okay. Meat's back on the menu, boys. <laughs> That's what you get. You stay away from my man. Coleman <laughs> uh, died. Okay. I'm a professional editor, though. Walking makes me hit wrong keys a lot. At least that's my excuse for today. I No, I found that, too. I found that, too. Professional editor. <laughs> All right, the the how do you say this? The dais. I don't think the double L here uh, makes the the Y sound. I feel like okay it was the difficult response to death in these trying times. Yeah, I think so. Well, he's dead. Okay. Uh, let's see. Oh, raft down the Columbia River. Hang on. Well, how do I know what the conditions are? I can't even hit the guide. The Barlow Toll Road. I we should do that. We should do that. I don't know how much it costs, but like we had, we had, uh, we have some money. It showed that it was, it was fun. It was money. All right. Should we hunt one more time? Let's try hunting one more time. Oh my gosh. Look at this landscape here. Okay. Oh, we got another bear. The bear are just kind of easy pickings, aren't they? Sorry. I have to do it again. All right. Specialize in three plus hour streams of chaos. Email me for pricing. Mods, feel free to kick me so kick me for self promo. <laughs> Pass some money rifling through Coleman's pockets like a couch. Oh gosh. Coleman was stashing away. He had this grand idea. Is that the Oregon Trail right there? No water. We're in fair health. We should be. We should be fine, friends. We should be fine. Which is kind of shocking. This is it, though, right? 
Hey, Bogan. Uh, Swear to God, no more casualties. Somebody just dies out of nowhere. Cheers. Welcome in, Bogan. How you doing? What you been up to, Bogan? Purple Mountain's majesty. Up on the Coleman-less plain. America, America. Coleman gave his life for thee. What we playing? Oh, come on, come on, Bogan. You know this, right? Never change your mic or settings. I don't even know how. I don't know what I could possibly change. My hand is over my heart. <laughs> we did it. We freaking did it. We've reached Willamette Valley. I cannot actually believe it. This game was too easy. Bogan probably doesn't be an Aussie. Oh, that's true. Yeah, that's true. From the window to the wall. To the wall. To the meat spills out my hall. My hall. Oh, these blackings crawl, crawl. Oh, ski, 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 ski. Oh, ski, ski. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, ski, 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 ski. Oh, ski, ski. Oh, man. Oh, man. Man, should I know what this game is? Uh, we we're all raising this game here in America, like required. Yeah, pretty much every uh, every kid that went to public school uh, played this game in school here. It's called the Oregon Trail, um, and uh, it's a uh, it's it's historical, but it was also it's a game, you know. So it was fun, fun for us to play in school. People in the 1800s made a journey across the country to colonize the West Coast. Foundation, uh, foundational American educational video game. Every American plays in every classroom. <laughs> and you wanted to quit. My hand is over my heart, though. Love that. Waiting for an oxen to die and you see Spooky tethered up to the wagon. <laughs> we did make a lot of buffalo extinct then processed. Yeah. Eating way too much food. Think you need to go sleep it off. One of the only games that were allowed to, uh, in public schools at the turn of the computer era. Be fun to have someone like Bogan play this. That would be pretty funny, actually. Yeah, Bogan would have to read all the lore. Congratulations, you have reached the Willamette Valley. Your life is now complete. Okay. Uh, let's see. My score was three thousand four hundred ninety. Hang on. What did, what did we get here? Four people arriving in fair health times four hundred. One wagon times fifty. Ten oxen. Wait, the wagon? Can you get there without a wagon? Ten oxen times four. Three spare wagon parts times two. Eight sets of clothing times two. Wait. Eight sets of clothing. Oh, no, that is right. Okay. So Coleman, we did bury Coleman naked, it turns out. Okay. Um. All right. And then let's see. Oh, the bullets? You get points for bullets divided by 50? What? Who cares? So your bullets are worthless. Uh, pounds of food divided by 25 is also kind of worthless. And then money divided by five, kind of worthless. So really, it's all about the health that you arrive in. The rest of us lived. It was only Coleman who died. Willamette. Live is a loose term. It's true. Yeah, we, well, no, we did live. We did not thrive. Nothing bad or hard will ever happen to you again. <laughs> Had to kill the Canadian before we got to the end so we could stay we could say we seceded with a hard American willpower. It was all yeah, it was all us Americans. Going for the five by eight floppy disk to play this game. Both gonna be like, American history is freaking insane after playing this. <laughs> How's everyone been? Been alright, Bogan. How about you? We start our life out west with our new baby, Coleman. <laughs> oh man. Okay, now I get it. It's a horror game about the uh, the rape and pillaging of the of the West. Kind of, yeah. It's uh, sort of didn't do that. They act like you could have had two wagons. I I don't know. Get out of here with that D. <laughs> Always remember the tragedy. I love that. Today's stream was good. Game crashed four times. What were you playing? Can't believe you made it without being able to type. I'm kind of surprised about that. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised. Do you want to save your trail journal? No, because I couldn't type in it. Couldn't type in it. Did I get a high score? 3,490. 
There we go. Loots. What does this mean? A greenhorn and adventurer? What are those? Those, those aren't the difficulty settings, are they? Because if I click... Hang on. Let's try this again. Travel the trail. Okay. Was there... There's no other difficulty, right? I didn't see one. Uh, I don't really have time to continue on, unfortunately. I wish I did. Uh, we could try a speed run for the... For like... I've got... I've got 15 minutes. I've got 15 minutes. We could try a speed run. I think the scores at the end uh, were different titles. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, what gives us the best multiplier? Teachers. Teachers have no teachers have nothing to uh nothing to give here. Let's do a speed run with it as a teacher. Um and uh oh you're playing some Phasmo? Play Odell's down under. Bogan will know all about that one. OT okay speed run? Hell yeah. Steven Meek needs to go down. You can call out and get 15 hours. Oh, I have an appointment that I got. Uh I got it starts at uh starts at eleven. I have to leave here at uh by ten thirty. Uh I probably can't type names. Yeah, I can't even type names. So we're going to have to go ahead and uh we're going to have to go ahead and kill this one here. Upon the Colemanless plains almost caused me to drive off the road. <laughs> I'm sorry about that, Mersa. Uh my my apologies. My apologies. Um Wait, could I have could I have relaunched the game? Well, I wouldn't have wanted to do that anyway. Um I've definitely killed, definitely killed this, uh, this DOS box one time before. Let me see if I can, uh, we'll try a new tab. I don't know if this is going to bring you guys back in or not. A PE teacher, did anyone, did anyone clip that Coleman list song? It's another old educational game like this from the same developer. All right, let's see. From the same developer, though? Really? All right. Travel the trail. Okay. Let's see if we can type now. Yes. Okay. All right. Uh, we had, um, it was going to be Nonder. And, uh, who was, who was the other one? Blue. Here, I'll give you guys, I'll give you guys actual names. How's that? Um, and then, uh, who else wants to be in on this speed run? Hopefully me tabbing out doesn't break it, but it might. Um. Uh, it'll be whoever is, let's see, where did this go? I'm about to re-enable, so have your, have your trigger fingers ready here. Um, I'm only going to be able to, you're only gonna be able to get two people in here. We've already got two. So be one of the first two to get this one here. Uh, as soon as I enable it, enabler, 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 it's a speed run and it's enabled. Check it out. Who are going to be the two that are going to join me on the trail? And hopefully, uh, this will work here. Put my legal name in there. Fattius. <laughs> get some redeems in there, friends. Only two spots. Went to Olive Garden for a taste of Italy. <laughs> taste of Italy. Fine Australian dining. So odd how the keyboard died on you mid-play. I know. I know. Very odd. No, Nobody wants in on this? It should be enabled. Oh, wait. Hang on. No, it's enabled. Anybody trying to get the redeems? I see it on mine. Which mobile won't let me? Oh, really? It's grayed out for me? Interesting. Okay. Won't let me. Can I? Well, let me. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Let me do this. Uh, it must have been because the the limit limit got hit. Okay, let's just go ahead and do that. And all right, just first two. How's that? All right, you should be able to hit it now. First two. We got Iron and Crystal are the first two. Iron and Crystal are the first two. All right. Hopefully it will let you join us. Yep. All right. And okay. So tabbing out is what kills my keyboard. Okay. So we're going to have to reboot this in one second here. One second.
You just call me Jonas. <laughs> Is that a redeem limit? I No, I had a, uh, not a cooldown. I put in a maximum amount, and it must have carried over from uh, the previous redeems, which was weird because it didn't, didn't work that way before. All right. Okay, I'm a teacher. Mr. Lutz. Uh, all right, we got <clears throat> Nonder. We got Blue. We got Iron. And we got Crystal. All right. Let's do this. Uh, we're going to leave in... Let's see, speedrun is going to be in August. And we're going to buy 20 Oxen so we can move as fast as possible. Uh, there are five of us, so we only each get one set of clothing. Box of bullets. Uh, let's just buy... Uh, we bought way too many last time. Spare wagon wheels. Mm-hmm. Pounds of food. Oh, I'm already over. I forgot I'm a teacher. I don't have any money. Um, wait, what I spend all the money on? Oh, I can't... I can't even... Have, okay. Maybe... Should I just buy 20 oxen? Nothing else? All right. Let's try 15 oxen. And then uh, we'll buy five sets of clothing. My, I didn't really even think about this food here. Um, yeah, try to see if we can get okay. Thirty more. Yeah, we're gonna have to. We're gonna have to do few rocks and okay. Ten oxen. It is fine. I guess. I guess. Um, box of bullets. Five of those, and then we'll do the rest. We got sixty here, so we can do two of each of those. All right, let's freaking do this. Pace is grueling. We'll do uh, filling meals, but we're on a grueling pace. It's a speed run, baby. Need bullets. Oh, we found some fruit already. Heck yeah. Easy peasy. He's not buying you any clothes. Did I buy any clothes? It is very hot. It's August. Um, Kansas River Crossing. What do we got here? Two feet deep. We're fording this, baby. We're fording this. No time to, no time to even think. We got to speed run this. Crossed it successfully. Let's go. Peeling out onto the Oregon Trail. No grass. It's August. We're in the greenest part of the... This is going to go great, right? Just hauling butt. The ordinance. <laughs> Did I really forget to get any clothes at all? No, I bought, I bought one set of clothes for everybody. We're good. We're good. Big Blue River. Two feet deep. Ford. Ford. Not even considering it. Good luck, all, all back to work. All right, all right. Uh, oh, we got stuck in the mud? Really? Heavy fog, lose a day. This is not helping our speed run. But we are really hauling butt right now. Mercer, have a great, have a great day and weekend. We will see you soon, my friend. Fort Kearney. Oh, I shoot, I actually meant to do something there because I now that I have my keyboard. Whoops. Whoopsie daisy. Bye, honey. Non, I allow it. No grass. Yep. Sorry, uh, sorry, oxen. Nothing we can do about that. Our health is already at fair, but we're already a third of the way there. Snake bite. Nonder was bitten by a snake. Nonder? Nonder was bitten by a snake. Um, I tried sucking the poison out, but... I don't know if it worked. Lol. All right, let's go. I'm going to get snake powers. <laughs> snake man. All right, we could do some trading here. I passed out after that. <laughs> All my skin is falling off already. Uh, Nander might be in trouble, though. Nander was the first. I cannot believe how fast we are moving. Fort, Fort Laramie. Should we try trading anything here? We are going to need to hunt. Can't hunt at night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. No water. So that's not a good place to hunt. Okay. Well, let's stop anyway. Oh, no. Actually, it might be fine. Might be fine. We got to find something bigger, though. Dang. I got to not, not go after anything with those... Uh, the gazelle-type creatures here are just way too fast, and they don't have any food on them anyway. Everyone chat. Oh no, I'll get bit by a snake. Help. Gazelle type creatures. I mean, do we have gazelle? I think I just I had to shoot him anyway. A gazelle? <laughs> Were there gazelle out here? 
pronghorns. Okay. Where are all the bigger creatures at? I feel like they, they should be here. There's water, you know? Fun concept for superhero comics is where you only get the worst part of creature powers. <laughs> uh, like being as like being dumb kind of thing. Brain not big enough to... Uh, oh, gosh. Yeah, we're in trouble. The timer is going to run out. Yeah. Okay, well... You know, he's been, uh, according to my RDR2 hunting knowledge, he would know he's been shooting a lot of pronghorns in RDR2. Crystal's suffering from exhaustion. Crystal, you're going to have to figure out that rest on your own. The Oregon Trail waits for nobody. Crystal is suffering from exhaustion. Uh, uh, we stayed up too late playing D&D. &D. <laughs> All right. Just slide on the ground everywhere. Also shed my entire body. <laughs> That'd be terrible. Oh, man. Could we... Let's see. Let's try hunting again. Nope. There's still no water. Okay. We are all... We are kind of running out of food here already. We got to go to meager. We got to go to meager. No uh, taste in the air is terrible. Iron is sick with typhoid. Oh, that's not good. That's really not good. Hang on. Can we read the guide on typhoid? I don't really have much time to read about typhoid, but I think it's probably in here. Oh, I just saw it. Typhoid. Typhoid is a serious disease caused by a bacterial infection of the bloodstream. It's usually spread by contaminated food or water. Early symptoms include fever, headache, and weakness, later followed by a red rash. Oftentimes, there's also diarrhea, nose bleeding, and coughing. Good food, water, and rest help in recovery, which may take several weeks. Untreated, it can lead to massive organ failure and death. Yeah, iron's gone. Rip. Rip iron. It is coming for sure. But we're halfway there. Just about halfway there. Can't buy an independence rock. We could try trading. If we were bring corals left over poopy water, we might have. Take a nap. You'll be good. No times for naps. Actually, could we rest here? Our health is very poor, though. Um, okay, let's rest for... Uh, we'll rest for three days. Uh, with our... Hopefully, our meager portions will be all right. Nander is well again. Oh, heck yeah. Okay. Crystal is well again. Okay, okay. Resting turns out uh, to actually matter here. Okay. We still got to be meager on the food, though. At least until we get some hunt. Oh, gosh. This is not the place to hunt. So these pronghorns run around in the sand and just dirt. Where are all the good... F Where's all the good food at? Massive Oregon failure. What? Anytime you click on a pronghorn, uh, it... Like, if it sits still... Uh, it's just a goner. Are these, will these rabbits count for anything? I don't think they will. Oh my gosh, that one's so freaking fast. Oh, that was a hit. Come on. Hit Reg's booty. Hit Reg's absolute cheeks. I gotta use our bullets, friends. I got to. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yo, Quinn, how you doing? This man is the deepest V-neck on Twitch. <laughs> oh, we're we're uh we're smooching it up here. 83 pounds. Of, that's actually not bad. I'd use 16 bullets to do it though. All right, here we go. Let's go. So aggressive with the red lettering. It was terrible. We had very poor health. Iron, I think, is still a dead woman. Crystal has a fever. That's that's trouble. Crystal has a fever. Iron as well? Are you kidding me? An ox is sick though. Okay, Iron maybe is, I I honestly I thought she was a goner. I thought she was a goner. Ha! Quinn, how are you doing? How's your weekend looking, my friend? She speed sped ran typhoid recovery South Pass. Oh, cool. Very cool. Very cool. Very cool. Continue. Uh, buy supplies? No thanks. I don't think I will. I think I'll take the shortcut. Supplies, mother freaker. No thanks. In one month, we made it half the way. This is actually pretty dang good, right? Buy supplies with what money? Yeah, I can't buy anything. You found an abandoned wagon containing one or 22 bullets and one wagon tongue? I was really hoping I could have just taken the wagon to get more score at the end, but that's not happening. Just moved and finally finished building furniture and decorating. Really? How was how's the move? Also, did you move? Wait. 
Cheeto, Cheeto moved too. Did you guys, wait, did you guys both move? Are you guys rooming together? So nice to get a move done before a weekend. Yeah, for sure. Green River Crossing. Let's see here. Uh, 40 feet deep. We're going to have to, oh no. We, well, we can't take a ferry. We don't have any money. So we got to, oh, this is bad. This is going to be really bad. This is going to be really bad. Can I slow down the pace before we do this? Hang on, let's go steady pace. I don't know if that matters for this, but um, fingers crossed, friends. It is real deep here. Oh, we're dead. We are freaking dead. Oh, the speed run was going so well. We all died. Oh, it was a TPK. Oh, no. Oh, no. Not a single one of us knew how to swim. Oh man, that speed run was going amazing too. Oh my God. I got over this typhoid for nothing. We're gonna stink up that water downstream, but hilarious if one person survived. Oh my gosh. Do you wanna write your epitaph? Yes. Here lies Lutz. Couldn't swim. Didn't. I can't put a, a, apostrophes. Didn't deserve Oregon. Oh, yeah. I don't know. No, save that. Okay. Wagon full of John Marstons. <laughs> after everyone was feeling better after crippling typhoid. I cannot believe that. Save it as a text file uh, on this like random DOS machine. Oh, friends. Wow. Well, this was fun. This was a lot of fun, actually. Ripped all of us. Survive. I s survival floated in swim class for three hours to die crossing a river. <laughs> what a way to end. If we had money, I would have. I would have paid for the ferry, but we didn't have any money. Thank you, Omina, for hanging out. Been here for, haven't been here for an end of stream in such a long time. It's great having you around, Nonder. Seriously appreciate it. Uh, let me go. So you actually get to see your name here, then, in that case. Played Mermaids too close to the sun. Too close to the sun. Gabby, thank you so much for the resub. Mod Squad on the day. Coleman and Iron. We also had a, uh, an appearance from Kirk, so shout out to Kirk, too. Uh, with the raids, we got Nonder, Terry, and Bogan. Thank you all for the raids. June Discord subbies, West Gabby, Peachy, and Ursa. Seriously appreciate that. Next week, work calls will start again. Will they really? Dang. You're important. You matter. You are enough. Agreed, Omina. Cheers, everybody. Seriously appreciate you hanging out. This was a lot of fun. Um, I'm sorry I killed us all at the end. I really... I kind of got backed into a corner. I didn't. I really didn't think we'd have a TPK on a wagon flip. My goodness, I knew the four, the forty feet was daunting, but uh, but yeah. Neko, hello, welcome in. Or is it Nico? So much fun. Thanks for stream loot and thanks for getting me to Oregon alive. Yeah, I think I owe you guys something. I said I would try to give a little prize to those that made it there. Coleman was an acceptable loss. The second was tragic. <laughs> Coleman, Coleman literally said that um. If if he uh, if he couldn't live in Canada, he didn't want to live at all. That's what he said. I, he told me that on the way, and I was like, "Come on, Coleman, it'll be great." And he's like, "Reed was different. Didn't know how to don't know how to explain it. All good, all good." Thanks, for Stream Lose. Have a great weekend, everybody. Have an amazing weekend. I'm off to the podiatrist um, for a second round of treatments. Very excited about that. Um, and hopefully we get our uh, garage and cars all fixed up today too. So busy day. But yeah, enjoy your foot, doctor. Doing well, though. Thanks for asking, Nico. Someone gets to see those feet. It's true. They do. Um, and I pay them, oddly enough, to see my feet. That seems that seems kind of backwards, right? But uh, anyway, friends, I love you all. Have an amazing rest of your Friday and weekend. I will see you next week. Uh, little, we'll have a little birthday stream on Monday. Um, it's It'll be the day after my birthday, but I want to I wanna see if there's a good way we can hang out um, with everybody. So, uh, so yeah. Go to the uh, podiatrist to get your cars work. Well, you know, maybe podiatrist uh, for feet, um, garage for the cars. But yeah, <laughs> friends, I love y'all. Have an amazing day and weekend. See you soon. Yeah.
Bye.